Roundabout design. In evaluating a roundabout alternative, the layout needs to be optimized for minimal impact on the surrounding area. A base map image will be used to provide context during the roundabout layout phase. The new transparency property enables users to apply transparency to objects and layers in the same way that colors, line types, and line weights are applied, streamlining the way drawings are managed. Transparent can, transparency can be set by layer, by block, or by individually for an object. Roundabout layout. While a roundabout is preferred option at one intersection being rehabilitated, the option would only be considered if it does not adversely impact the environment or cause the need to move major utilities. As shown in the base map image, a water tower is in close proximity to the intersection. The water tower cannot be moved and will likely be a consideration when laying out a roundabout. The first step in determining the feasibility of a roundabout at this location is to perform the two-dimensional geometric layout based on local standards. It looks as though the roundabout size and configuration that was requested by the local agency will not fit in this location without significant impact to the water tower. It looks as though the roundabout size and configuration that was requested by the local agency will not fit in this location without significant impact to the water tower. Our next step is to make some minor modifications before a roundabout alternative is ruled out. Edit a roundabout. To demonstrate the dynamic nature of the roundabout layout, a geometric change to the approach roads will be made. In addition, changes to the roundabout geometry itself will be evaluated. It appears that a roundabout alternative will not work at this location without significant changes to the geometry of approach alignment, so other options will be examined. Two-dimensional roundabout geometry can be quickly created using standards employed by your local agency. This provides a quick and easy way to evaluate, evaluate roundabout sizing and impacts when intersection alternatives are being assessed. In the final design, the 2D layout can be used as the foundation for corridor modeling through the intersection using existing methods. The roundabout geometry, including the central island and slip lanes, will automatically adjust when changes are made to the approach alignment, saving time during the evaluation process and when last-minute design changes are needed.